Hello Camigos! I am here to do a thrift haul from the Stanwood Camino Island thrift store. I went on Thursday which is their $5 bag sale, $5 clothing bag sale and apparently in March they have a $4 bag sale on Monday and then on Thursdays and Saturdays are the $5 bag sale. So I didn't really score too much, but I still did score a bunch of stuff. So I'm gonna actually film this differently. I have my ring light, but I don't know if I wanna use it, but I'm just gonna go ahead and describe the clothes and everything in front of a mirror. So I'm gonna try something different, bear with me. If you guys like this type of filming, let me know because then I really want to experiment and you know change it up a little just because I've been doing my thrift hauls the same way since I started my channel. So yeah, and also I don't know if this lighting is bad, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, okay, so let's get into the video. Okay guys, so this is what I have. It's just a shirt that I can use for sleeping or what I'll, what I wanted to go ahead and do is make it into a muscle tee. It says, I love dogs, it's humans that I, that annoy me. Um, but I wanted to go to make it a crop top and mus or a muscle tee depending on what it was, but it's pretty big. It's pretty big. Yeah. So I can work with it. I can work with it. Alrighty, so the next thing that I have here is just a, a tank top and honestly it fits me on the larger side just because it is actually perfect for like yoga or like working out at the gym, but yeah, so that's pretty cool. Alrighty, this next shirt that I have is by Delia's and it's a more loose type of top. It's like a light, lighter purple pinky side or pinky color it has that like band at the bottom where it like tightens a little bit so it's almost like a bubbly um middle part which is okay and i just really like the boat neckline right here i like that a lot and yeah so again once again this would be perfect for hot yoga or you know yeah Alrighty, next shirt I have is just a red t-shirt that is pretty plain. It's like an extra large, I believe. It just says Peru on it. And you guys know that I have been to Peru to volunteer. So yeah, I think that's pretty cool. I wanted to go ahead and make it into a crop top. And yeah, just wear it with like regular jeans. And yeah, so that's pretty cool. Alrighty, the next shirt that I have here is just a dark blue shirt. And it says a woman's place in the... A woman's place is in the White House, and I just thought that was super cute. Oh, I get better lighting here, but yeah, I like it. It's just like really like a loose type of shirt, and I can wear this to the gym, or I can wear it with like, you know, this is a casual type of day, and just wear it with jeans or shorts or something, probably tie it up here, and you know, yeah. Alrighty, the next shirt I have here is by Nike. It says One Man Hustle, and again, just another gym shirt that I wanted to go ahead and score but it's black and it fits me pretty good. This is a UW shirt and it's by Victoria's Secret Pink. It has a big W on it with a bunch of hearts surrounding it and yeah I just like the way it fit on me. It's fitted but it's loose a little so you know you don't have to necessarily suck in the whole time. All right so this top is pretty interesting. Let me see. It's a little bit shorter. It looks really really cropped. It's an interesting uh, pattern here and it goes all the way to the top so I'm not sure really what I would wear with this to be honest but it's really cropped really really cropped <laughs> so there was a blue one and so of course there was going to be a different color just open this up a bit but it's the same it's a little bit well it's a little bit bigger but yeah it's an interesting dress shirt i think what i compare this with is like a pencil skirt or something for work yeah so these are express jeans and they're like bell bottomy i don't know if you can see them but i actually like the way that they fit they fit pretty good so yeah if the thing would move move go that way up yeah it's so like really bell bottomy see all right guys, so these are skinny jeans. These are by Mossimo and they're like a, I don't know if that's burgundy or plum, but they fit me really well. Um, I don't think I really have Mossimo jeans, but they don't fit too bad. They don't fit too bad. Brady, I have here Capris, I believe, that are Max Jean is what the brand is called. And you guys, I'm actually surprised that this fits me so well. Like. 
I'm actually pretty happy about it. They fit me very, very well. Um, I'm not quite sure about like the bell bottoms on the bottom of the capris. It just like, I don't know, it makes it seem like I'm wearing really high waters, but I think what I can do is just fold it up or something. Make it worse possibly, or make it better, whatever. <laughs> Alrighty, this is another Capri. This is by Base Jeans or Bash Jeans, but it's high-waisted. It has a little bit of leeway here, which I'm not really digging. I want to say it's like a mom jean style type of type of Capri. Um, it's a little bit on the looser end, but I mean, I'm not even mad at it. I'm not even mad at it. Okay, you guys, before you come at me in the comments, I actually bought this for my mom. She likes this type of material of jeans or... I don't even know what the brand is. I suck at checking the brands. Oh, this is H&M. It's like a really funky color, but I think this would fit my mom really well. I mean, it fits me really well, so yeah. She likes these types of pants, so. This is for my mom. Sorry, excuse all the ding hair, but it's just Caprice. Again, she likes this style, um, this material but it's like a pre and it has like little embroidered um, flowers on there so it's super cute so these jeans are by air pastel fun fact i used to work for air pastels yeah they're just they look like they're just regular um types of flared out jeans i actually like these because these are the short version if you guys don't know air pastel has long short extra short and regular extra yeah or extra long but um, I've always been an extra short, so this is an XS, so it, fit, it fits me just right, like almost like a petite size would. I have these leggings from Massimo. Can't really go wrong with leggings, to be honest, so yeah, they're just the basic run-of-the-mill black leggings. So these are like black, I want to say these are like jeggings because the fit is just so weird. A lot of space up here as well as the back, like I don't understand what's going on, like... I really don't like what is this but it's by buffalo yeah i don't know what i'm gonna do with these actually interesting all right you guys so you gotta work with me here these are lee's jeans and what i was trying to do or wanted to do because i thought they were going to be higher and tighter but i guess not i wanted to go ahead and cut these and make them into cut off jeans because i feel like these would be perfect for them but now that i'm looking at them i feel like I overreached on it and there's just too much space over here we'll see we'll see and then same thing with these these are just like a little bit more bluer they are tied around the waist but they're really loose like right here because if i were to make these shorts like how loose would these shorts be but yeah here's that these are by gloria vanderbilt they're more high-waisted i want to say this is more like a mom jean style they're pretty high up they're khaki type of material, jean, jean khaki type of material. I was debating on whether to make this into jean shorts, but we'll see. We'll see. I think I like them how they are right now, so. Alrighty, so I had a vision for these shorts. I thought, I mean, they are high-waisted, but they're a little bit more on the loose side. So what I'm probably going to do is just put a belt up here, and then I'm going to cut these really, really short or hem them a little up here. You know, because they look really long, but I mean, they have potential, guys. They have potential to be up there, so yeah. Okay, guys, that was my different type of styling. The tops, I filmed it in hand so you guys can see me, but I feel like it was like jumbling a little bit too much. I tend to like move the camera like a crap ton. So I changed it over to just having it like on a, well, I have it on a Hello Kitty stool <laughs> and then I'll just talk about it as I'm wearing it. So let me know, or if you guys like the old way, I really want your feedback because I want to start doing things a little bit differently if possible. But if you guys like it the old way, more than happy to do that. So yeah. Alrighty, so I ended up getting charged two bags this time around because of all the jeans and bottoms that I bought. So for, how many items do I have? Hold on, pause. Alrighty, sorry I had to count how many items I have, but I have a total of 20 items for $10.91. So that equates to like about two bucks a piece, which is not bad, not bad at all. So yeah, well I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys did, go and give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more videos by me, click that red subscribe button. It would totally make my day and I will see you guys later. Bye. Just FYI guys, I do have a vlogging channel. I think it'll be linked somewhere on the screen. Yeah. 
go ahead and check it out for the random adventures that I go on if you guys want to follow me besides having just regular sit down videos like this and if you guys want to see what's going on in my life yeah go ahead and subscribe and 